The pregnancy is accidentally on purpose. It was a happy accident, maybe subconsciously on purpose. She's still working through it. This is a big, big adjustment in her life with, you know, a guy she met on a date and then had a one-night stand and is pregnant and then has this boyfriend on again, off again, who won't commit, and so she has to manage. And her beautiful sister, who's also severely annoying but hilarious, and Nick plays Davis, who plays his best friend. He's also severely annoying. Yeah, yeah, definitely. And hilarious. And hilarious. <laughs> this is actually based on a book of a true story called Accidentally on Purpose. So it's inspired up the book completely. The uh, knocked up similarity is actually coincidental. The problems and the issues are not anywhere near the issues that are in Knocked Up. Yeah. This guy wants to be involved. I want and the baby. Yeah. I want the baby. And he's much younger, yeah, which yeah, is a factor. I am much younger. A whole lot cuter. My character's a film critic, and he's my boss, and so I have to face him at work every day, which is, like, not a happy thing, um, and manage this thing, because now he's a little more interested in me now that he can't have me and now that I'm pregnant. He's moving in with me, but we're not having sex, so I really don't have a relationship, but I'm pregnant. What does my character do? Gets her knocked up, or pregnant. I've probably ever stopped saying knocked up. <laughs> um, yes, no, I, I, I meet her at a bar, and I somehow get her home, and we... Uh, we end up making naughty, and then somehow she ends up pregnant, and we have to reap the repercussions. He doesn't have a job. No. No. But I do end up wanting the baby. So here we are. I'm the only one in his life, uh, of his friends, that actually has his own apartment. So he was sleeping on my couch and kind of taking advantage of my generosity. Uh, so I actually have my life in order, more or less. Uh, but whenever I get a chance, I'll go to her house and steal all her good food, because it's a lot better than mine. How do I annoy her? I give her lots of terrible advice. I think I'm. I, I think I know what I'm talking about, but I don't really. It's fun. I'm her boss and ex-boyfriend, and am suddenly realizing how important she is, and maybe a little bit too late.